Okay, well, let me organize things here, and I will rejoin you guys again. Okay, and there we have it. Felt the, uh, if we, until we can get a pedestal, at least keeping with the gold felt right. So, <sighs> still such a wonderful sight. Which actually brings me to, what are we going to do next? We're going to go back for this. Um, I think it's time. So, as we walk, I think I would like to discuss something with you guys. Something that I think I said I was going to do way back when I decided to change the LP format. Um, that I was going to try and keep you guys in the loop of what I planned on doing in the future, so that way you guys could have ample opportunity to give me suggestions on possible design choices or avenues of... Uh, I, I don't know. Just... You know, any chance to have your input, so that way you still get to have some choice in this. I mean, I know at the beginning of this recording set today, I said I wanted to change the LP because the choice seems to be going, but I still want to keep some stuff around, even if the name does change. Um, so, plans for the future? I want to move. Yep, move. <laughs> Probably the most radical thing I want to do given everything we've been doing here. Um, I don't know when exactly, but I know I want to move. Now, where you might be asking? Um, well, for those of you who have seen the map on the website recently, or even since the end of Chapter 5, you will know all the places that we have explored. And unfortunately, because that was back in Beta 1.3, the terrain generator has since had a lot of updates and changes to it, and there's a lot of things that just aren't going to be in those chunks. So, what I was thinking is if you look at Resurrection sta Station, go ahead, you can pause the video, go go check the map, it's right there on the website, blacknocturn.com, I believe, slash world. Go ahead, go on, I'll wait. Okay, so... You saw Resurrection Station. Did you happen to notice all the wintry area to the the north of it? Um, I believe the north of it. But you'll notice that it the map seems to cut pretty abruptly right there. And, well, that means there's plenty of new stuff to be discovered there. And so I think that is the general direction I want to go. And given the snowiness of it, that actually will work out really well for my plans. Hmm. You know, with the diamond there and the diamond here, I almost wonder how much diamond was connecting those two before the terrain generator cl clobbered it with air pieces for making the cave here. Although I can't complain too much. If it hadn't, I probably wouldn't have ever seen the diamonds in the first place. Um, so yes, move. Um, I'd also like to build something really epic, but functional. Um, but not a mob factory. Uh, I've had a lot of requests for that in comments recently, and I guess I'll, I'll tell you guys as a whole what I keep telling everyone in the comments. I actually ended up building a mob factory in my private world way back in, oh, I don't know, way back in Alpha. And it was a ton of fun to build. It worked really well. But as soon as I was done building it, it was like, huh. Well, the game just got really, really easy, and now I'm kind of bored. And I was hoping the Halloween update was going to bring it back for me, but me being a little bit bored compiled or compounded with the badness of the Halloween update, the boo update. Oh, it was three. <laughs> that I almost stopped playing the game. So, and you guys know that on a number of occasions that I have mentioned there are things that I don't like doing because it makes the game too easy. So, yeah. There will be no mob factories or mob towers, at least not for a while and not until I change my mind. But if there's anything else you guys can think of that are that's just really just, ooh, wow. And look what it does. Um, I would love to hear it. Um, and if you have any designs that maybe you could show off for me that 
I wouldn't say copy, but uh, lovingly replicate, maybe? <laughs> um, or at least use as a basis for something. I know I was getting a haircut the other day, and you know, when you go to get your haircut, they've got all those random magazines, usually fashion magazines, but I mean, those were all there too, but for some reason they had an architecture magazine there too. And I was like, hmm, interesting. Maybe there's some inspiration here. And I actually took a picture of some floor plans I found in that magazine, so I might see if I can replicate that in Minecraft one day. I don't know. A little bit of lag tonight. Okay. But there's that. Um, as I said when we first came back down into this cave, oh, I don't know, 20 episodes ago by now, maybe? <laughs> that I want to go ahead and build some mine tracks from Resurrection Station to the house. And... Oh... Thank you, game. I was so hoping that wasn't another one-block disappointment. And I think, since we did actually come down here for the gold, that will probably be the first thing we hit, so I don't know how many suggestions you guys could leave me on that, but... Other interesting transportation systems would be kind of cool. Um, something I could use some help with... Potential designs for Minecraft stations... Or, Minecraft... Minecart! stations now that the um, booster cart has been officially broken and we have to use booster tracks now um, I haven't seen any updated designs for that since Notch fixed it so I don't know if anyone's come up with things or what's going on with that but um, just got turned around <laughs> let's go back mm, there we go okay so there's that and I will probably need quite a bit of help with that stuff, as I am terrible at redstone. As some of you have seen firsthand on SMP Weekends. <laughs> Let's see, I think that was all the diamond. And my god, man, has this been a ton of diamond in this cave. And what did we just walk away with? Ten! <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. That, that was nice. That was very nice. But I think we are going to go ahead and run back to the base again. And drop this stuff off. Before we pick up on the next little piece of things I want to do tonight. Um, let me see. Was there anything else? Plans for the future that I wanted to do? Um, a lot of this stuff I want to actually try and get done before one night, one eight, Because depending on things, I might end up moving anyway just to explore the new chunks, depending on how Notch works the adventure stuff into the game. Because I've heard a lot of stuff that suggests that adventure is now going to be a separate mode, like hard, easy, normal, peaceful. That this is going to be the update where he actually adds, like, creative difficulty, I guess? Adventure difficulty, and then whatever this, dif whatever this gets called. Um, I've also heard that it's just going to be something that you can turn on and off. And easy, hard, pe normal, peaceful is still always going to be there like it is, but I don't know. I mean, depending if it ends up becoming its whole own mode, that it might just be worth it to start a new map. Or, I don't even know. But yeah, so I mean, depending on... You know what? I've been hearing these guys make noise every time I walk by here. I know I've got 10 diamond on me, and I just said we were going to do something else, but... Driving me crazy, man. Where are you at? You're making all sorts of noise up there. I know there was water too, because I remember hearing zombies splashing around. Getting close. More up, it sounds like. And I'm just messing this thing all up. <laughs> there we go. All fixed. Over here. Okay. 
Hey! Whoa! And you have friends! <laughs> Hi! You have lots of friends! Oh, you have lots of more friends! Word make no sense now. Mouth out, come. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Four creepers. Huh. <sighs> Huh. Five creepers. Oh my god. Alright, um... I don't want to risk losing ten diamond because I do something stupid, so... I'll be right back here to meet you guys again once I've dropped those off. Just wanted to show you guys they're safe. I'll see you back uh, where the massive creepers were in a second. Alright, here we go. I wonder if anyone else wants to say hello now. Well, I'm thinking about it. There we go. Anybody else? Always up. So nothing jumps on your head. This is probably not too big of an area. Just, you know kind of has that feel to it. And I was right. <laughs> okay, so now I'm a little confused. Um, I've walked by here and heard zombies splashing in water, so... Um, you guys notice anything missing? Yeah. Where's the water? <laughs> hmm. How weird. And weird. And odd. <laughs> okay, well. Um, let me try and finish what I was saying about things a second ago. Uh, yeah, plans. Um, so, I mean, depending on how much... I mean, I've said this before. Depending on how much I really like the 1.8 update, I'll definitely do the SMP. I'll, I will either definitely or definitely not do the SMP thing. If I don't think it's worth the SMP thing, then... Depending on how Notch, like I was saying earlier, how Notch integrates adventure stuff into the current game, we may or may not be starting a new world anyway, so I'd like to get a lot of these things that I've had planning in the back of my mind done soon. So that way we can actually have fun seeing them and actually get around to them. So, let's see. Oh, something else I should mention. This kind of irks me. When I was copy-pasting Metal Pig's... You shut up in there. Uh, cave base design into the LP world. I, uh... Mm, copied too much. <laughs> so... Yeah. The skeleton dungeon has disappeared. This is something I plan on fixing on my own, um, off-screen, so that way we can actually have our Aero Factory back. Um, not sure how you guys feel about it, because, I mean, technically I didn't build this, but I didn't really build it in the first place, because Metal Pig built it. Um, I don't know, I mean, copy-pasting is not really something you can really do in this game, so maybe this is my punishment. I don't know, I will... I'll leave it up to you guys. I'd really like to see the Arrow Factory back up and running, but like I said, up to you. Um, so let's see. Something I want to do next. Um, I think both you and I have seen enough K for a while, so we're going to go build something. I'm sure this is you guys right now, jumping up and down for joy. Oh, thank God, no more cave. I know I was trying not to say anything mean about it, but f*** that cave. <laughs> Where did my torch go? It, whatever. <laughs> uh, okay, so, what are we going to do then? Well, we're going to do what we set out to do, or rather, what we wanted to do because we set out to do the... 
this is not making sense. The reason we went to the cave was to get gold. Why'd we get gold? So we can make booster tracks. There. <laughs> That's all clear now, right? Excellent. So, I'm going to take much of this with me. I'm going to leave much of this behind, too. Um, so... Hmm. I think, let me organize, and I'll meet you guys back at the... I don't know, the... Whatever it is at the front of the, the cave, that little rest stop I set up. So, see you guys in a second. Okay, guys, here we are, back at the front of the cave with our little rest stop area. So, I wanted to show you guys just what I brought with me. Just kind of get let you guys stare at that. You can pause right now if you want to get a better look, but this is basically what I'm bringing. So, just finally head upstairs for the first time, and my god, I don't even know how long. <laughs> I think the last time we saw sunlight was when we went and found that outside surface zombie dungeon. Which reminds me, I still need to go back and grab the mossy from that one day, but that's for later. Um, hopefully there's not too many surprises waiting for us up here. Ah, oh, good. Alright, so, with the, oh, there you are. Hey, look, wolves, run along. Yeah, not a huge fan of the wolf in this game. I mean, it's cool Notch added a new mob and all, but that he added it for his, well, that he added it as a way to impress someone, eh, I don't know. It's like, it wasn't all that cleanly done or something. I don't know. I mean, whatever. Enough about the wolves. So, to see what we've got here now. Did you look at that? That's a stack of diamond right there, guys. That's a stack of diamond. You know, I probably didn't need to bring this up with, with me after all. Oh well. No harm, no foul being up here. So... I, I, I need to see this. Mmm. Look at that, guys. Have you ever seen anything more beautiful? And, I mean, 100% legitimately gotten to. That's just... Ah. And we forced the game to save... Just because this is a beta after all, so you never know. I mean, 1.7 has been a fairly stable update, but just in case. There we go. All right. Um, there we go. Okay. Uh, let me go ahead and get organized again, and I will meet you guys back down at the bottom of the safety drop. Oh, this... I'll explain that in a second. This was, uh, necessary. 